Just wanted to do another quick video showing some of the stuff I got in for today. I got one autograph in the mail and I also got in um, some stuff from the uh, Goodwill store and the stamp shop. So let me just show that really quickly. I got one TTM Success with one of my famous envelopes there and it was from Doug G-W-O-S-D-Z, Gwadzd or whatever, on a 1988 uh, Pro Cards uh, minor league card. And I've been starting to collect those because I like the gold and the silver borders on those and they come out very nicely. The pictures are not always very cool, but uh, there, there it is right there. So that's the one I got in today. I went to the stamp shop that I have locally and they sell lots of uh, damaged and, and uh, used stamps. I mean not used stamps but technically used because there's either no gum or there's some damage to it uh, for fi uh, either face value for the perfect ones or 50% um, off for the junk ones and they also sell me a lot of these envelopes here which have never been used 29 cent you know 29 29 and they're all um, brand new they just in their half price but they just need the extra postage on it so might as well buy as many as I can and then I got uh, some tokens. There's two guys there, and, and one guy sells a lot of old tokens. And he sells these for a nickel apiece. Can you believe that? These are from Joe Dini's Lucky Club in Urington, Nevada. And they're good for 10 cents. Uh, not anymore, but, you know, on the usual Sambo's token, which a lot of people may remember from the years ago. And uh, let's see if we can show them better. Some tax tokens and some telephone tokens and... Russian subway tokens. Just really common stuff, but it's really cool stuff. And then I got some baseball cards at the Goodwill. And some of these action packs. There were so many of those, but I didn't get all of them. I just got some. There's an old Keith Hernandez and a Dan Meyer and, you know, some pull-out cards from Kraft and, and a few other others of those. And then the main thing I got was a big stack of those Donruss postcard size trading cards. I'm not sure where I put those, but I got a whole ton of those. If you remember back in 85, 84 and 85, and they had a bunch of those. And I got some America Airline pins, Milan, Italy. Let's see, American Airlines appreciate you. Ask me about America Airlines, and it says, I think, Central America on the bottom of it. I can't, Central America. And so, oh yeah, and I got one other thing. I got a, a radio station belt buckle, which was kind of cool probably from the 70s and so all of that was I think a total of 13 or 14 dollars there's more envelopes and stamps that I've already used but uh, you get the idea um, just the one autograph and uh, thank you for watching